In the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. And the earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the deep. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the waters. And God said, Let there be light. And there was light. What is sound? Because we think that sound is just something that travels at a finite uh, speed. Well, that's been busted now because in Tennessee, uh, you studied at, at, uh, in Tennessee, didn't you, Brooks? Uh, at the Middle State Tennessee University in 2005, there were three high school students and two undergraduates that proved that sound travels beyond the speed of light. I'm not going to go into that, but that's an interesting thing to contemplate. That's one of the best-kept secrets of science and physics. Never made it into the mainstream news bulletins. Sound boils water. This is a guy called Peter Davy in New Zealand. Since 1940, this guy's been boiling water with sound, sound frequency. It's not complicated because everything has a resonance. Everything in the creation and in physical form has its own fundamental resonant frequencies. If we understand the resonance and the sound behind the resonance, we can do everything. Because if sound created the universe and all things in it, because that was done by God, then we should be able to use sound to do everything else. 